how's it going everybody? Burr Brian here and it's been a while since I did a video so I wanted to give you an update on what's been going on in my life and of course with the state of the world today I kind of wanted to check in and see how all of you are doing. Several months back I started a journey towards better health by trying to lose some weight, changing my nutrition, changing you know basically the way I eat, the food that I put in my body and uh, so far things have been going really really good. I bought this awesome workout routine that's had me in the gym five days a week getting up every morning at 4 a.m. so that I could be at the gym by 5 a.m. to work out till 6, 6.15 and they'll give me just about enough time to get home, shower, change and get ready for a long day at work. And then came this pandemic and all of our lives were forced to change so we had to kind of figure out new ways to do things and uh, gyms were one of those things that were deemed non-essential. They were closed down. I guess I can somewhat understand it might be easy to spread germs when you're in this uh, little area. Though again, at the same time, they do say that exercise and healthy people in general uh, are less susceptible to this thing that's going around. But uh, either way, this thing forced us to change the way we're living our lives. And a lot of people I saw on Facebook were just giving up. They're like, man, how am I supposed to keep up with my routine? I had everything in order. I kind of felt that way a little bit. But instead of just falling down this hole of depression and going, man, all this work I've done is, is for nothing. Now nah, I went to Walmart and I spent money like $150, $200, bought a bunch of gym stuff. So I got floor mats. I got uh, you know some different uh, dumbbell weights and a couple other exercise equipments, things that I thought that I could use uh, here in my little makeshift home gym. And uh, it's honestly been awesome. I've been able to keep up with things really well and uh, it's led to some pretty good results. So speaking of results, when I started uh, my whole exercise routine, I was at the biggest I've ever been at 273 pounds and I just felt miserable. Every day sucked. Waking up in the morning sucked. I hated working. I'd come home and just wanted to sit on my ass and do nothing. And uh, it was just a really kind of shitty way to live life. But it took some real dedication to focusing on exercising every day as well as paying close attention to the foods you eat. Things that have really helped me are, you know, there's this app called MyFitnessPal. It's really amazing. It's a free app where you can get the premium version, but the free app suits my needs. It allows me to plug in anything that I eat throughout the day, breakfast, lunch, and dinner, snacks, all of that stuff, and it'll give you a really good breakdown of your macros so you can track how many protein, carbs, fat you've intake. Uh, and just kind of give you a good breakdown on the other nutrients that are in the food you're eating as well as allowing you to really keep an eye on your net carbs, how much you're bringing in versus putting out. Uh, and so I think that's really been helpful to losing weight. I highly recommend if you're trying to lose a few extra pounds, definitely put, a, put pick up the app and start plugging in the food you're eating. And I'm pretty sure you're going to be amazed at the calories that are in some of the stuff uh, that we put in and just don't even think about. Another great tool has been this. I picked up the Fitbit Versa 2 and honestly I was a little skeptical about trackers. I just didn't think that they were really functional or that they didn't they really didn't serve much of a purpose. But honestly this thing is so much more than just a pedometer. It gives me a lot of great insights into the progress that I'm making. And honestly as someone who played video games all my life, being a gamer, it, this really gives me the opportunity to, to turn life, turn my exercises into a challenge, into like a video game challenge, as stupid as that might sound. It's like every day when I go out there, I try to beat my steps for the previous day. I try to, you know, if you will, beat my high score from the previous day. And it's just, it's nice. It makes it fun and easy to track your progress, to see how you're doing. I can link this with my uh, fitness pal so that all the calories that I burn are calculated there as well into my total uh, net calorie count at the end. At the same time, I can link it to my scale, which is a Bluetooth scale, so that that's also tracking my weight loss and all the other interesting, fun um, statistics that this scale will produce. So. Honestly, it's just a great tool. I do high, highly recommend something like this, like the Fitbit series, different series. It really kind of depends what you're looking to track. Uh, the sleep tracker has also been awesome, uh, just on a random thought, but uh, really definitely a handy tool. As far as my actual progress, as of today, I am now at 238 pounds. Um, so I have lost now 35 pounds which is great. It's, it's awesome. Uh, I feel so much better. I have so much energy. I'm happy for a change. I don't always feel depressed and run down and tired. Uh, and it's, I don't know, man, it's totally changed my outlook on life. My sharpness, my mental focus has gone way up. It's really helped me with my work life, my professional stuff. And uh, I got to say, I feel great. I've lost so much weight around my belly, around my waist. 
and uh, hips and all that. And I'm continuing this process. I still have a long way to go. To me, I still have at least another 30, 40 pounds to go. Maybe it depends how much muscle I actually gain or continue to gain during this process because I haven't just burned fat and lost weight. I've also gained muscle. Um, so all of that's going to play a factor in the end, but I can't tell you how good I feel. With all the gyms being closed, I still wanted to maintain a routine, so here's just a look at a few of the things I've been doing to stay active. Coming up soon, I will definitely do some photos so you'll be able to see my where I started to where I'm at. Uh, I'm not quite comfortable there yet to show those kind of photos, uh, but soon. We're coming, coming very soon. Hey, if you enjoyed this video, be sure and give it a big thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, subscribe so you don't miss out on any future content. I do have a lot of great hot sauce videos coming. I've got three, four, nine, ten, at least ten new hot sauces that are here or on the way. So I'm going to be cranking out those. Uh, here very soon. And again, I appreciate all you guys' support, the motivation. Um, I, I mean, I don't know where the motivation came for myself. Um, I, I really have tried to just stay focused every day on my goals, trying to achieve them. I've cut out a lot of uh, the drinking, the everyday drinking, the alcohol um, abuse, I guess you could say, that I, I was doing. The, I've cut out all the crappy food, a lot of the processed craps, the ever not, every night frozen pizza, the two, 3,000 calorie meals that I was putting in. Cut all of that stuff out. Life is so much better, guys. And uh, hopefully you'll see the positivity coming out of me and the, the good energy. Uh, and, and I hope it's infectious, especially during the dark times that we're in right now. Everybody is so down and depressed about life. And I hope that maybe you can see the, the spark that I have and, and maybe it'll inspire you to, to not fall into the hole in depression, to continue being happy and, and try to to continue living a, a good life despite all that's going on in the world. Anyway, love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, we'll see you in the next video.